How you doing? Mike from Morning Auto. I'm gonna show you how to get a stuck tire off. All right, this vehicle's got aluminum rims and the, the tire is basically corroded to the, uh, the brake disc. So I'm just gonna put one, first thing I'm gonna do, just put one lug nut on, okay? And then you can, you know, give it a good pull. Obviously make sure your vehicle is well supported. Pull it, the lug nut will just keep the tire from flying off. This one's stuck on there really well. So what you can do is lower your car back onto the ground. I'm just gonna put a couple more lug nuts on. With the lug nuts just loose, obviously the lug nuts are holding the wheel on, but they're loose. A lot of times once you put the weight back on the wheel, it'll pop it, okay? Didn't happen on this one. So the next thing you can do is try to shake the car side, side, side. Okay, that still didn't work. Raise it back up, get as large of a pry bar as you can. Make sure when you pry, you're not prying a brake line or anything like that. I'm gonna just loosen up the lug nuts really well. All right, hopefully you saw the wheel move. Take the lug nuts off the rest of the way and take the wheel off. Okay, to prevent that from happening again, what you wanna do, or the right way to do it, is to use some anti-seize compound, and you just put just a little dab, and then you wanna make sure it's just a light coat, okay? The other thing you can do is if you don't have anti-seize, you can just use some regular motor oil, and again, I have a rag here in my hand, just because you wanna dip it in and you just want to put a really light thin coat because you don't want the motor oil to end up getting all over your brakes so just make sure it's a really really thin coat and that motor oil will help to keep that wheel from getting stuck to the brake again and once you coated the back of the wheel put the wheel in place thread the top lug nut on first and you can use that push the bottom on Thread those on. Tighten up preliminarily. Lower the vehicle down onto the ground. Make sure it's in park or the wheel's blocked and torque the lug nuts to 100 foot-pounds. And use a star pattern. Thanks for watching. Visit 1AAuto.com, your place for DIY auto repairs, for great parts, great service, and more content.